Go out there. Gotta clean my lens. What's up, what's up, what's up? Anybody out there? You too. What's up going on? <clears throat> Anybody out there? Here, it's Sat uh, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, just watched my uh, my Raiders get their ass beat. <laughs> Pretty bad. Yeah, but um, so we're just hanging out, dude. I got time. I still got daylight. It's pretty warm out here, and um, what um, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna mess around with my uh with my truck. I know I told you guys I I do a uh, um, um what you call it uh, um a build my truck build. Yeah, I can't think right now, dude. I had I had buddies here yesterday for NASCAR. My NASCAR, my NASCAR buds um, had people fly in from North Carolina, all over the country, drove up from California, and um, they kicked it here. Um, after the race, uh, they did the race, and then after the race, they came here, and we partied all night, dude, till shit. I think it was like, I think I didn't go, go inside till about 1.30 in the morning. So um, it was a, I wanted to do this before the game, but I just woke up too late, and I was like, I'm, out of my, I'm not going to be trying to rush and everything and um you know i want to be able to enjoy the game not all greasy and everything so um you know i still got daylight hopefully i can do this today in one in one day not not too much not too hard it's pretty straightforward so but i've never done i've never done i'm gonna i'm gonna do uh, let me show you guys what i got going on let me see who's up here matt what's up bro chris what up miguel how about them boys yeah how about them boys man uh, yay, yay, que onda, carnal? Hey, I'm gonna be mechanic right now. Uh, Eugene, ha ha ha. <laughs> ah, you fuckers, man. <laughs> Oscar, if I bring nine pounds of meat, could you barbecue it? Hey, bro, if you can bring nine pounds of meat, I bring the beer. I say that's a party. I think I think that's a hangout. You know what I mean? Uh, Roman, what up? All about that nation. Hey, you know what's up, dog? You know what's up? Raider Nation for life. Anyways, uh, let me show you guys uh, what I got going on. Here, uh, here I got my uh, my K5 Blazer. Um, let me show you guys what happened. What happened? Let me show you guys. Oh, you, oh, you gotta crawl under this damn thing. All right. I blew up my room. Uh, this is kind of like chewed up. My gears are uh, a little chewed up and stuff. And then uh, the big one is, if you guys can see that pinion in the back, uh, I broke my gears, broke some teeth off them. See them? And uh, here are the pieces. <laughs> uh, it broke on me Friday uh, last week coming going home from work and uh it just uh it busted on me and uh i was lucky it didn't freeze up i was able to uh clunk all the way home so uh now i'm forced to uh do this project sooner all right come on all right so what we got going on today is i got some uh these are uh three quarter ton axles um uh, 14 bolt and uh, eight lugs. Let me show you the lugs. Eight lugs uh, with a uh, floating axle. Uh, so uh, a lot stronger than what I have right there. Um, half ton. And um, those are 33s. And these are 35s. So let me, uh, let me take... I, I put these tires on so I can move the axle easier um because uh if you guys don't know these axles bro are, <laughs> are heavy as hell <laughs> they are a bitch to move so um these i just i just uh bolt up some uh some lugs and uh put a tire on and then go from there so, so um let me give you a comparison of the size if i don't crush my fingers there we go all right all right, here we go. So 
So, let me show you the comparison of these tires. If I can just line them up pretty straight. There you go. So, so I'm going from, uh, let me see, let me go a little further back. A little bigger than I thought. I'm going from 33s to uh, 35s. Um, both set of tires are 12 and a half inch wide. I'm um, running uh, 15 inch uh, uh, rims, wheels. So it's gonna look, uh, it's look pretty badass, dude. So, so today, what I'm gonna do is do uh, get rid of these uh, these drum brakes, and I'm gonna go to a uh, disc disc brakes and uh um i got a kit here i got some new calipers uh uh the back plate to hold everything in place um and then uh, uh these rotors right here and uh so what i got to do is uh unbolt these up um, slide the slide the whole axle out and then take the drum off and um, from there um, I got to bang out these uh, lug nuts and uh, reuse reuse them onto uh, the rotors put everything back and uh, that's about it it's pretty easy I'm not gonna mess with the brake lines it comes with brake lines so I don't know depending how you know how much time I got I don't know if I'm gonna put the brake line on um, we're not gonna we're not gonna put these on for a while because um, I have uh, the lift kit. This is a four inch lift kit. Um, I got a, a six inch lift kit um, parts that are coming in. And um, dude, <laughs> I was supposed to have that lift kit this weekend so we can start jacking this up, tearing it down. But you know, uh, I, got, I got the hardware uh, the brake lines and uh, the U-bolts and all that stuff. Everything came but the springs, dude. The springs are going to be delivered tomorrow. Good thing I got Monday, Tuesday off because I was going to work on this truck. So um, hopefully uh, I get them tomorrow by FedEx. And, uh, you know, I get them kind of early. You know, I don't want to wait till 3 o'clock to get them. And then, you know, we, we're going to be sitting around waiting for damn packages to come. So I'm hoping I can pick that up. Um, have it dropped off uh, early in the day and you know we can just tear this down real quick and if anything if we can't finish up tom um, tomorrow then we got Tuesday and uh, stuff like that so let me uh let me see who's up here I got more people coming in GVAA better swap out the front axle with the same it is it is I am I got let me show you guys up I got, I got the uh I got the front ones over here and stuff. Same thing, I put these up on uh, on wheels so it'd be a lot easier to move them instead of, you know, trying to, uh, you know, manhandle them. So that's about it. So what I'm gonna do with this one is uh, I'm gonna take it, we're gonna load this up, take it to a shop because uh, and when I picked it up from the junkyard, um, the gears, oh, I got the cover on. Yeah, I got the cover on. Um, the gears were uh, were gone, so um, so what I'm gonna do is uh, take it to the the shop, and I'm gonna have it pretty much uh, refurbished the whole thing um, with the ball joints and all that stuff, and uh, you know new bushings and stuff like that. So make it brand new, and then, uh, what I'm gonna do also is uh, I'm going on a crossover steering where. Right now, I have your conventional, you're just a regular uh, steering suspension. I'm going to go with the crossover. So, you know, it'll give me a little more play for flexing when I go off-road. So, um, I got the knuckle that's going to go on. Um, so, I'm going to give that to them. And then they're, they're pretty much going to just do the whole thing all brand new for me and all that. And all I got to do is just pick it up. Once it's all done, once it's all done, then... Uh, we're gonna hold just slap it on and uh we should be good to go so these uh this rear this rear was uh geared at 410 so i'm gonna keep them i'm gonna keep them at 410 
and stuff like that and um you know it's just uh it's gonna be a it's gonna be a good good little project you know i've never i've never done uh a suspension or even uh an axle swap and this is gonna be my first uh conversion uh disc conversion that i'm gonna do so um it's pretty easy you know what i mean um i got hopefully i got two hours of light so i can do most of it uh today so you know that's what i wanted to show you guys and um steve ah oh, homie hey thanks brother great appreciate it bro <laughs> that's gonna help out in buying parts because uh it's becoming an expensive project dude let me tell you the the, the wheels and tires uh it was an expense that i bought these axles from a junkyard um that's uh you know um pretty good money right there and then uh the crossover steering i mean dude um this whole project is going to be easy maybe five grand for me and stuff like that so you know um i appreciate it bro hey thank you brother you know what i mean um hey um steve um let me see hey, hey um send me a message bro if you can send me a message um give me an address and um i might i might send you some uh i'm not might i'll send you some uh some decals black hole brotherhood decals um for that thank you bro appreciate bottom of my heart um let me see so yeah we're just gonna i'm gonna do that and i got time so it's hopefully i don't i don't run into any problems and stuff like that so uh, hopefully uh i'm gonna i'm gonna start documenting um this whole build and with small videos and stuff like that and uh you know we'll we'll do it up and uh you know we'll see what's up yeah the barbecue thing it's still gonna happen dude um right now i got this coming up and uh you know it's gonna take some some time during the week or my weekends the next couple weeks and stuff like that but uh like last night dude we had a good time my my nascar buds they came down we we partied up right now they're at the race uh going on so we might hang out to, again tonight because i got we got a whole a whole grip of of beer beer and and some food so you know they might pick up some food on the way over here and, and we'll do it up again you know what i mean do it all over again man that's, that's just what i do you know what i mean black hole barbecue it's just uh you know a place where we all hang out dude you know what i mean and and, and i hope you guys uh um you know uh, uh kind of see where i'm coming from you know what i mean it's not it's not all about you know who makes the best barbecue or or this and that or or being famous you know what i mean you know i got followers you know but i don't i don't consider you guys uh you know fa or subscribers or followers uh, some of you guys have been pretty good friends you know what i mean so you guys are homies to me any any guys that follow my page um i don't consider you guys uh subscribers you know what i mean or followers you guys are buds you know you guys are you know part of my my friends you know and stuff like that so I'm gonna I'm gonna cut loose and uh I might I might go back on live and and see where we're at with this if I can get it done you know what I mean so everybody out there be good dude appreciate it, all all the love and support you guys giving me um, all these years and currently you know we're you know um, some things might be coming up let me let me just say that with uh, black hole you know what I mean uh, some opportunities might be coming up and uh, um, we'll see where it goes you know what I mean and and, and like I said dude. I do this out of fun, you know, I already have a job. Um, I do this pretty much as a hobby, you know, I keep saying that over and over again. So, you know, um, what I what I do and say sometimes um, rubs the people, some rubs some people the wrong way, you know what I mean, on, on how I how we come across, you know what I mean? When you guys, when you guys see me barbecue, dude, I'm always drinking. I might swear once in a while this and that but to some people they, they you know something like that they, they they might consider it unprofessional dude i'm not here to do this for any money or any popularity i'm just trying to share a part of my life and what makes me tick and this truck is a little bit a part of that i know it's not barbecue but it's a little bit of my background and 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 stuff like that so you get to see what what black hole barbecue is all about you know what i mean and just having a good time bro you know I mean, I can care less where you're from, what skin, creed, religion, gender. It, it's all bullshit, dude. You know, just have a good heart, good mind, and we can hang out, dude. You know what I mean? So let me get going, man. I'm talking. I got to 
work on this and uh we'll see what's up but i might if i if i finish up i might i might uh come back and uh show you guys what we're doing you know what i mean so um manny what's up bro shannon barbos <laughs> my wife <laughs> wait, wait, wait. i gotta see that again shit where to go i got a hobby for you baby <laughs> Oh man, hey man, I don't know if I'm gonna finish this job tonight, bro. <laughs> I might get a better offer. <laughs> oh, that was bad. <laughs> oh my god, man. See, dude, it just—it's all fun, dude. It's all fun. You know what I mean? Nothing. I, I don't take nothing too. I don't take all this stuff too serious. It should be fun, like all, like anything, man. You know what I mean? Don't don't treat this as a job. You know, I treat it as as just a, a fun thing I do. You know what I mean? So, uh, late to the party, but how are we doing, Joe? Oh, we're doing good, bro. We're doing good. I know I, I haven't been on, on YouTube in a while uh, with any videos. It's just right now, dude, it's too hot to do anything to, to cook, especially to, to try to document uh, a whole cook from start to finish and all that. My phone uh, overheats and then it's, it stops working. So, it, it kind of sucks to, to sit and get a, a, a two, three minute video of cooking and then I'm talking away and all of a sudden it just turns off and then I lost. I only got maybe a minute out of that two minute part and it just you know it, it it doesn't it doesn't work out so hopefully um you know as it cools down i i have some cooks i want to do and stuff like that um and uh you'll see them you'll see them uh mario hey joe i love watching your channel keep up the great hey thank you brother thank you thank you and um and like i said hey steve if you're still watching dude um uh try to message me uh through instagram um my black hole page um and stuff like that and send me a message and, and uh um uh give me your address and uh i'll i'll, I'll send you some uh some decals you know what i mean so thank you brother thank you everybody and uh let me let me get to work and maybe we'll come back or you know uh, my wife's got a better hobby than uh you know i'll see you guys maybe tomorrow <laughs> i'm out of here man black hole barbecue brotherhood you guys know what's up yeah yeah good times baby good times <laughs> Hi right, man, I have to watch you. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Uh hey Joe, Mo, have a good one. Hey, you guys be good, man. I'll see you guys later on. Let me get let me get to work and uh we'll see what's up. All right. All right, later. Yo, yo. All right, I'll turn this off. All right, turn this off. There we go. Hi right, man, I'm out here. <laughs>